Hi, it's Mike from Flex Radio, VA3MW. I'm going to take a quick tour on getting uh, FreeDV version 2.1 installed and working on your computer. Uh, I'm going to skip over some of the low-level stuff, assuming you can do all that. If you're fr not familiar with using CAT and DAX within a smart SDR environment, uh, there are other videos you can go look at that. So the in the beginning, you're going to go find FreeDV. You can Google it to find uh, the uh, FreeDV uh, application and get it installed on your computer that does take a while and ultimately when you're done you're gonna get something that looks like uh, this uh, I said this will be a high level thing so it'll it just covers the key steps under tools there is a free DV setup where you need to set the key parts free DV is no different than any other digital mode you need to be able to receive digital uh, radio signals you need to be able to transmit that digital digital signal. You need to go in and out of transmit, and ideally, you'd like it to change frequency for you. So, step one: select the sound device, DAX Audio RX1. Uh, that's uh, this RX1 here. And if I, uh, I'll just get this out of the way really quickly, and um, we'll move free DV out of here. We're going to go to DAX RX1. And you see we've got some red, we've got a signal here, we happen to be on 20 meters. That's RX1, so set that uh, and slice A. All right, back into easy setup. All right, so decoded audio plays back through. This is the sound card in your computer. I use a virtual mixer uh, called Voice Meter. Uh, you can drop that open. Yes, there's a lot of devices here, but look for something that says generally speakers. Uh, and you may have to play around with this. You're not going to break anything, but it's just telling the application, uh, the free DV application, where to play the decoded audio. So that's, ga that's good. Uh, transmitted audio. Uh, in my case, I'm going out through, uh, again, my, it's being picked up by uh, voice meter which is my uh, mixer but again look for something that has a microphone uh, like if I was using my Jabra headset it would look like that or my mic in uh, type of thing all right then I would just jump into advanced to make sure this is correct going to advanced we've already set the receive so let's look at transmit uh, input from microphone uh, I said voice meter uh, which is my mixer again look for a microphone input and then for my transmit, you want DAX audio TX uh, outbound. And that is where the audio goes from the computer out here through DAX into the radio. So that's done. Cancel that. Uh, for me, for, okay, cat radio control, for push to talk and frequency, I select ham live. I selected the flex radio, uh, 6,000, same for the 8,000, same for the Aurora, it doesn't matter. Uh, the serial device 127.0.0.1 means it's local host, means it's your computer behind the firewall, so use that. And in my case, it says this is the port after the colon, 5002. And right over here in CAT, you'll see that I have slice A on port 5002. If that's not there, uh, you can uh, make another one by adding it. Uh, it can be used by other devices, but not at the same time. So that's done, hit apply. Uh, you may want to uh, set up um, the free DV reporter, which is nice and handy. Uh, and that will give you, um, you get to see who's on the air and where. And they're all R in a RAD, I guess that means R-A-D-E-V-1. And uh, in theory, we could go listen to them uh, and know what frequency they're on. Now that uh, I have that done, we'll come back to uh, this in a minute. Uh, we want to make sure for 20 meters we are in DigiU. And I set mine for 3 kilohertz. So I've started my modem. If there's uh, noise coming out, you'll hear. I'm going to change down, drop down to, um, oh, we are on 40 meters. Let's go up to 20. By the way, uh, one thing to notice, when we're on 40, we're in Digi-L, Digi-Lower. Let's go see if anybody's on 20. It's early in the morning here, 2.36. And you notice I just changed frequency here. The mode changed here. We still have audio here. 
and there's uh, nobody on. All right, while we're, uh, just in case somebody shows up, uh, what I want to do now is I want to save some of my environment. So I am going to create a transmit profile called, uh, save, create a transmit profile called a free DB. Okay, create. So I've created a transmit profile called FreeDV. I might as well create a mic profile as well called FreeDV. Create. And so it's there now. So we now see we have a FreeDV uh, transmit profile. We have a FreeDV mic profile. We have DAX on, so that's for our transmitted audio. And we might as well make a 20 meter global profile which uh, saves all our settings called, uh, in my case, I'm going to use free DV-20 meters. And I'm going to hit save. And now, anytime I want to go to free DV uh, on 20, uh, it will just recall, recall it. So let's just move our frequency. Uh, let's change our mode to upper sideband. And to show you how those work, I'm going to go to profiles. Uh, it's still on my quick pick list. This will restore the radio to where we are. And just to check, we're on antenna one, 20 meters, free DV uh, for a transmit profile and free DV for a, a mic profile. Uh, and this is called a digital mode group. Now, is it is it all working? Uh, I'm gonna turn my power down here just for a minute. And I'm gonna use push to talk. Now you use push to talk on the free DV app here. And uh, if I click it, you're going to see my mic audio there. And you will see uh, no transmit uh, signal because I turned my power down. But uh, one, two, three, three, two, one. But I also want to make sure that your mic level here is sitting about there. Don't overdrive the radio. And uh, when you're done talking, you turn transmit off. So that's free DV for a flex radio quick walkthrough. 7-3 mic, VA3MW.